Criminals beware. It's Monday and my co-anchor Byron Brown is working with the Rankin County Sheriff's Department. He joins us now live with tonight's Mississippi's Most Wanted. Byron. Well, Melly, we are here in Rankin County. We're looking for three more fugitives tonight, and we're here with Rankin County DA Michael Guest. And Michael, we are looking for Cravari Jackson. What can you tell me about Cravari? Uh, the Pearl Police Department received a 911 call regarding a domestic disturbance uh, between the defendant and his wife. Uh, when they arrived at the home, uh, they encountered the wife along with several children there in the house. Uh, there was clearly evidence that there had been a disturbance. Uh, as they began to speak with the wife, she stated that her husband began to assault her uh, and then at some point began to choke her. Uh, officers noticed uh, marks or, uh, bruising around her neck. Uh, this individual was uh, then later apprehended uh, shortly thereafter that evening close to the home. Uh, he has uh, been indicted and failed to appear for trial, and his last known address is Prestige Lane in Pearl. Mr. Willie Garrett. Mr. Garrett, the uh, Flowood Police Department uh, had a confidential informant working with them. Uh, that confidential informant uh, contacted Mr. Garrett uh, and s arranged to purchase $200 of cocaine. Uh, when Mr. Garrett arrived at the uh, location to sell the drugs, the Flowood Police Department then moved in, uh, placed Mr. Garrett under arrest before the sale occurred. Uh, so on searching Mr. Garrett's person, uh, officers located uh, in his possession 3.8 grams of cocaine and over $600 in cash. Uh, there is an unserved indictment uh, for um, his charges, and his last known address was McCoy Drive in Brandon. And Terrell Jenkins is someone we featured before, but we're still looking for him. Yeah, still looking for Terrell Jenkins. Mr. Jenkins uh, has been indicted uh, and charged with uh, two counts, one uh, felony evasion, the other uh, possession of stolen property. Uh, the uh, Rankin County Sheriff's Department and the Pearl Police Department had received information from Simpson County that there was a stolen vehicle believed to be in our area. A uh, patrolman uh, saw the vehicle uh, as it was traveling on, on the roads. Uh, officers uh, then uh, fell in behind the vehicle and attempted to initiate a traffic stop. Uh, the vehicle then fled away at a high rate of speed. Uh, the chase ensued for several minutes. Uh, ultimately, uh, the chase ended when the defendant was able to stop the vehicle and then bail out on foot, uh, ran into a, a wooded area, uh, and has not yet been apprehended. Uh, he since uh, since that time has now been indicted for both receiving stolen property and felony evasion. His last known address was East Petros Road in Pearl. All right, thank you there, Michael. And if you know where these fugitives are, you can also uh, go to our website, WJTV.com, and look at their mugshots again or our Facebook page. And if you know where they are, call the Rankin County Sheriff's Department or Crime Stoppers. Melanie, now back to you.